Hello everyone, um, today I'm going to be showing you some Minecraft TNT cannon designs and also this is my first video so please like and subscribe. So anyway, this is the first cannon um, and it's by EY Stream. He's a popular YouTuber, you should know him. So I'm just going to change my view to first person. One second. So, yeah, it's pretty simple. So you just climb up this ladder over here and press this button. And what happens is, so this dispenser drops some TNT and this this piston pushes pushes the slime block and which launches the TNT. Yeah, and it doesn't take up much, many resources, so it's good for a survival world. Uh, if you you can, and you don't have to actually like make this sort of pillar. You can just put it right outside your base, like on the wall of your base, and then this is a the rapid fire TNT cannon, and it's by. A YouTuber called It's Professor Creeper and it just like you fire a bunch of TNT and and then it's pretty long range so it lasted all the way up to here. Like, so. Here's, um, turn on this lever and then a bunch of TNT is dispensed and and then it's launched into the air and yeah so when you stop it it keeps going on for a few seconds but yeah and over here is like a pretty simple tnt cannon that's similar to this one but like I made it, so yeah, you have to place TNT here, and yeah, and then press the button. And that's it for this video. Wait, actually, wait. No, I have to show you how to build them. So we're gonna start with this, this one by EY Stream. So, first you just stack up a bunch of blocks. So, um, I'm just going to use uh, iron. Um, so, you stack up some the iron. Yeah, you can do it um, as high as you want. If you want more range, then you should do higher. And then you're gonna want to place one block of it in right on the side. Yeah. So this is the direction we're firing. So um, yeah. So place the sticky piston in the direction you're firing. So it should be on the side of the obsidian block the side of the obsidian block so and then place a slime block over on the sticky piston and then an obsidian on top of the slime block and then just place a normal block in between the two obsidian blocks and place a dispenser wait I don't have a dispenser facing down and place a sensor facing down like off the side of the iron of the block and break the iron block or whatever block you're using and then you should have a shape serve like this and then uh, just place a repeater 
over here and two tick delay. Do a two tick delay and yeah, just load the load the cannon with some TNT. And then yeah, that's the cannon. And then just place a button on top of the dispenser or on the side, whichever you want. And then just place, if you're using it on pillar, then just place ladders, a bunch of ladders. Oops. So then just press the button. Wait, oops. Must have done something wrong. Wait. Did I forget anything? Oh wait, on, yeah, on top of the piston you have to place um you have to place the redstone dust. Yeah. And then I'm just gonna fix this. Like this. And now you should, yep. Okay, so that's how to build it. And then this cannon, so just place like nine blocks in a three by three square. And then over here, pre place a repeater in the middle, and then, wait. On this side, place a comparator, and turn the comparator on. And then, place a lever over here. Over here. Yeah, and then that's the first bit. Oh wait, no. Wait. Oops. Yeah, and then, wait, I was placing it in the wrong direction. And then put a lever behind the, the comparator. And then on the side which the comparator is on, place four dispensers facing inside the machine. And then on this side, it's five blocks. Wait. Place five blocks. And then on top of this redstone, no, wait, no, sorry. Place a slab. Place some slabs 
and it go all the way up to the end of the dispensers. And then over on the on top of the last block, um, block of choice, place a dispenser and a ladder underneath the dispenser. And then over here, so crouch and then place redstone on top of the four dispensers on the sides. And then, place some repeaters over here. And then turn this comparator on. And then just load the cadence. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. Oh wait, no, I forgot. So, and then place a water bucket there. If it doesn't flow out of the cannon, then you're good. And then just load it with TNT. And that's it. And then the last cannon is pretty much just um, stack up of any block. And then make a four by two, no, four by three square of obsidian. Um, and place a piston coming out of this butt. Oh yeah, you should place a button on the corner and then place a piston going away from the button. And then put some redstone stone dust coming out of the button wait yeah like this and then place a slime block in front of the piss of the sticky piston and and a block of TNT right in front of the slime block. And then that's the cannon. Okay, so that's it for this video. Bye.